Mission Monday family, how you living? That is this week's mission, but I owe you some context and an explanation of exactly what I mean by that. So I want to tell you about one of my best friends of all time. His name is Nate Piper. Nate, if you're listening, shout out. Uh, Nate and I got to know each other way back in the day where we both taught middle school together. I was an eighth grade teacher. He was a sixth grade teacher. He still is still killing it in that capacity at Horizon Middle School. And Nate, on the regular, will just shoot me a text that just says, hey, brother, how you living? No other context besides that. He just wants to check in and see how I'm doing. Is it good? Is it bad? Just wants me to know he's got my six, he's got my back, he's invested in how I am doing. And I was thinking about that as I drive to work today. Um, it's one of the best things in my life for my own mental health, that I know that there's somebody who on the regular, for no other reason than they care about me, is just gonna check in. So that's what your mission is this week. I want you to do a check-in with somebody. Think of someone that you know, and you can do this via text, via email, phone call, in person, and just let them know, hey, I'm just checking in. How you doing? Or how you living? Or whatever your phrase is. But the important part is that you go out of your way to intentionally check in with someone that you care about, so that they know you care about them and you're invested, that you have their back. So, Mission Monday family, how you living? Make sure you ask somebody else. Let them know you're checking in. All right, that's all I have, except Mark and I are going to be on our way to Wisconsin for the conference out there. Um, excited to see those folks that are part of WORSA, the Rural Schools Association in Wisconsin. Um, other than that, I would love it if you go to missionmonday.com, and I love you guys.